Good morning. So it's been a second since I've done a what do I eat in a day vlog and Coachella is around the corner. So I, and by around the corner, I mean in five days and I am going to start my health kick today. So um, I wanted to show you what I'm going to eat this week. I'm going to be a very regimen creature of habit. So I'm gonna do a little meal prep this morning. I'm going to show you some great snacks that you should have and we are going to feel our Coachella festival season summer body best. I eat pretty clean anyway, but this week I'm like no chocolate. That's gonna be hard for me. But without further ado, I am going to show you the go-to smoothie I do when I am being like clean AF. So I have my vanilla nut milk, brand new. It is more boring than other smoothies that I've made, but I have found a way to make it be really good. So we're gonna take about a cup and a half eyeball cup and a half here put the lid on so I don't drop it so the rule is when I am trying to be super super healthy it is to stick to one ingredient things so I don't really cut foods out like you're gonna see we're gonna make sweet potato fries later I don't cut foods out I just keep it to one ingredient word so for example hemp protein instead of using my vanilla hemp protein that has a little bit of coconut sugar in it and a little bit of stevia we are going as plain as yet in this only ingredient organic hemp protein so a three tablespoon serving is about 80 calories and how many grams of protein 11 grams of protein so we have one, two, three tablespoons of hemp protein for our protein powder. For our fat, we have Georgia Grinders pecan butter. Absolutely love this stuff. And this is going to be me finishing the entire thing. So we have one tablespoon. I finish it, but we're gonna pour our smoothie into here so I get every last little Bite. Fiber, chia seeds. This also makes it nice and creamy. So I add a tablespoon into there. Okay, so now as you can imagine, the flavor is pretty meh. So we have some blueberries. Frozen blueberries gonna give us some creaminess and give us flavor. We're gonna add a quarter cup of frozen blueberries. And for our veggie, for our quote green, we're gonna do a, probably a quarter cup to a half cup frozen rice cauliflower. We have our smoothie, nice blue color because of the blueberries. Take our jar fun drinking out of the used jar. Z-licious. Honestly, because you use the vanilla nut milk, it has a great flavor. So, highly recommend this. Mm, I can drink this all right now. So this is what I'll have in the morning. Now, we know that that's not going to fill me up until lunch. So what do I have as my snack? Probably around 11 a.m. today, I'll get hungry for my next something. Here is a jar of almond butter that is bigger than my head. I will have a tablespoon of almond butter and that will for sure hold me over until lunch. Oh man, it's so good. This nut butter has little chunks in it of almonds. Delicious, bigger than my head. So now I'm gonna go on my morning walk, come back and I'll prep lunch and dinner for the day. Cheers. Okay, so I was going to show you what I make for lunch and then later on at dinner, show you what I make for dinner, but I'm actually around today. So as I try on my Coachella stagecoach outfits, um, I'm going to make a whole bunch of healthy things right now. Um, so that I have it over the next, it's like my version of meal prep, so I have it over the next like two or three days. And then out of it, I will show you the ideal 
ideal meals that I'm going to make from it. So let me show you what I have going on. So I have a tablespoon of olive oil heating up on my skillet and I have these turkey burgers. Applegate, no antibiotics, use gluten-free, dairy-free, all the things free. Really like this brand. We're gonna make um, a bunch of turkey patties. I have some zucchinis that I'm going to boil, some cauliflower rice that I'm going to steam. My favorite meal right now is taking a turkey burger and putting it on a bed of cauliflower rice. Separately, I have an eight ounce piece of Arctic char that will get me two meals of protein um, and then some eggs. So this is what we're gonna do. Okay, I got the turkey burgers, usually about four minutes each side, making four. I have two pasture-raised organic eggs from Vital Farms. Go in here and wild Arctic char. Dress with olive oil, salt, and pepper. Gonna put it in the oven at 400 degrees for 12 and a half minutes. I always undercook it a little bit because eventually you're gonna have to reheat it and you don't wanna dry it out, so you wanna leave it so that it still has a little cook time left. And I'll do my veggies. Okay, right here I have eight ounces of wild Arctic char on top of three cups of shredded zoodles with a half avocado. I wanna be as real as possible. I will only be eating half of this for lunch and the other half will be tomorrow's lunch. That is a lot of food right there. I have my two eggs. Eggs are amazing. Let's say I had a smoothie this morning, but let's say I want uh, eggs and potatoes tomorrow. That's totally okay. Or maybe I want an egg as a snack. Maybe instead of chips, I want a few roasted potatoes as a snack. Maybe I want some steamed zucchini as a snack. Or I have my three turkey burgers here. The fourth one, this is what I'm gonna have for dinner tonight. It's a cup and a half of steamed cauliflower rice with a turkey burger. If I'm still hungry, I will add another half. That's why I really have these cut into halves. Um, you could have a half turkey burger or full turkey burger as a snack. I can pair this with this. So meal prep just gives you a bunch of food laid out that you can play with over the course of the week and that is what I enjoy doing. So I'm not really good at meal prep but I know I'm gonna be around a lot this week for my meals so this is what I'll be having. If you like seeing my meal prep or if you like seeing what I eat in a day, comment, like, let me know. Um, I wanna make more things that you guys will like so I'm off to Coachella and I'm gonna have fun and I'm gonna eat all this food this week and I'm gonna be feeling my best, so thank you and subscribe.